Filmora now gives you the option to create a thumbnail when you export, but you can also create one within Filmora. Let me show you both options. Hello, I'm John and this is Fun with Filmora. Lights, camera, action! Let's have some fun. The first option is how to create a thumbnail when you export your video. Let me show you how that works. So you've got your video, you're happy with it, you're ready to export it. Click on export, create video. And there's an option here now in Filmora 12 to change thumbnail. If you click on that, you'll see your video here. You can scrub through, which means you can click and drag the little play line and stop on a section of the video that you'd like to see as your thumbnail. So let's choose the one where the seal is looking straight at us and click on set as thumbnail. That now changes and when you export your video that will be your thumbnail. Easy. But what if you want text and maybe an image of yourself on the thumbnail as well? Well let me show you how to do that. We'll just cancel that. We've got our video there. The first thing to do which is very important is to lock that track there so that we can't cause any problems or make any errors or any edits that we don't want to do on it. Okay, now that's locked. Go to the section of the video that you want to use as your thumbnail. So I'll say that there, that's a nice one. We can now go to titles and drag some text on. I'll drag the neon title there. I'll just call this a seal because that's what the animal is. I shall move it up to the top left hand corner by clicking and dragging. It's a little bit big, so I'll just shrink it down. There we go. And now I want an image of me here on the right hand side. So I'm going to go to media and import an image of me. Um, that one there. Drag that again onto the timeline. And Reposition and resize, you can resize by clicking and dragging the handle, don't forget. And reposition purely by clicking and holding and dragging. I'll put that on the right hand side there. Probably a little bit big, let me just shrink that down and move myself down a bit. Okay, that'll do, it looks like I'm pointing to the word seal there. Then what you want to do is make sure you're happy with the image of the video you have in the background. And there's a thumbnail. All you do now is you click on Snapshot. It asks you where you want to save it. You can save it in the default folder or you can choose a folder. So if I click on that and then choose wherever you want. I'll put mine on the desktop. Select folder and just do OK. You'll also notice that your thumbnail is also in here now. Don't forget to delete the text and the image before you export your video fully because that is purely for the thumbnail. If you want to see where you've saved your thumbnail, you can right click on it and go to Reveal and Explorer. This shows you the folder where it's in, mine's on my desktop and there it is there. Let's just click on that, open it up and there we have the thumbnail with text and an image. How easy was that? Hope you enjoyed that little tutorial. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please let me know in the comments below. And don't forget, always have a play around, enjoy what you're doing. Thanks for watching, go have some fun.